The number of mosquito samples testing positive this year for West Nile virus has skyrocketed compared to last year. Last year we only had 10 positives. This year we've so far as of right now have over 600. Vector Control Division Manager John Townsend says weather and bird patterns are responsible for the increase. A lot of it's kind of due to the weather. Most of the mosquitoes that cause or carry West Nile come from more permanent bodies of water like say swimming pools, ponds, that type of thing. It just all depends on what's going on in the bird population because they're the ones that actually carry West Nile virus and St. Louis encephalitis. And then the mosquitoes pick it up from them. Unfortunately, this uptick in mosquitoes testing positive for West Nile virus has also led to more humans contracting the virus. By the last week of September, nearly 140 people in Maricopa County had tested positive for West Nile virus, compared to the same time last year when only three people contracted the virus. This year's cases have resulted in seven deaths compared to the same time last year when one person had died from the virus. Vector Control has been doing its part to set mosquito traps test for diseases at their lab and fog areas that test positive for West Nile virus. If we catch more than 300 floodwater mosquitoes, that's a trigger to go out and treat for the adults. If we catch more than 30 of the nighttime biting Culex mosquitoes, that's a trigger to go out and, and treat for the adult mosquitoes. Or if any size sample, you could have one mosquito and if it tests positive for West Nile virus. But there are things you can do at your own home to protect you and your family from this sometimes deadly virus. Get rid of any standing water. If you don't have standing water, the mosquitoes can't go through their life cycle. Just if you're experiencing mosquitoes to wear repellent, long sleeve, shirt, pants, you know, just protect yourself from being bitten. For more information on how to protect yourself from West Nile virus, go to fightthebitemaricopa.org.